I've been trying to figure out if I want to talk about this or not because it's not actual like psychological advice, but it's just my take. I genuinely think the reason I don't have body dysmorphia after training for so long is like threefold. One, I've been training for so goddamn long. Like at this point, and pff, what is there to feel uncomfortable about at this point? That's one. Two, I'm big regard because I've been training for so long. I am big. I can't try and gaslight myself into thinking I'm not that big because I'm standing next to whoever I'm standing next to. Someone else can be bigger does not negate the fact that I am big. Three, I don't place my value in what I look like. Like, that's just not... Maybe because I've been doing sports for so long. Like, my value in myself is not based in what I look like. I look like what I look like because of what I'm able to do. I, I place my value in what I'm able to do. So, I don't know. If, if that helps you, that helps you. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But I think part of the reason I have body dysmorphia is because of where they place their value. And for me, it's just in my abilities. 